some big tech legislation. Sure. Um, do you know if the president supports the House package of antitrust bills to rein in big tech? Um, I know that they were brought up in June. Yeah. Um, has he asked the speaker to bring any of those bills to the floor? So here's where we are. Um, I mean, the president's view is that um, the history of the country suggests that strong antitrust laws have been a key to American technological leadership and preeminence. Uh, and for generations, American our, Amer our approach has been to expose our main tech firms to more competition. The president has been very clear in his view that we need more competition in the tech industry. That's his fundamental view. You saw that in uh, the executive order on competition he signed in July. Uh, and uh, his view is that uh, over the past 10 years, the largest tech platforms have, uh, as they've acquired hundreds of companies, including alleged killer acquisitions meant to shut down a potential comp competitive threat, that's not a healthy place for the system. And the large platforms, um, the, the large platform's power gives them unfair opportunities uh, to get a leg up on small businesses that, re uh, that rely on them to reach customers. Um, the president also called on federal agencies like DOJ and the FTC to use their existing tools to tackle these problems uh, in the executive order. I know you're specifically asking about the legislation. We're continuing, we're encouraged, he's encouraged, uh, to see bipartisan interest in Congress in passing legislation to address the power of tech platforms through antitrust legislation and to protect privacy. I don't think we've done a statement yet of administrative policy on this particular legislation, but we're in, in discussion and we are encouraged by um, the bipartisan interest in doing something about this.